This demonstration covers the new functionality in Microsoft Dynamics GP version 2013 to clear recurring amounts in General Ledger transaction entry. We begin by navigating to the financial landing page of Dynamics to transactions. Within batch entry, I'll look up my previously prepared batch header. Note that the frequency is set to monthly. That enables this checkbox to clear recurring amounts. I'll ignore some of the other functionality on the batch header. I'll go ahead and navigate to transactions. In transaction entry, I'll browse by journal entry number and go back, which brings up my previously prepared transaction. I've further added to this entry by setting the transaction type to be a reversing entry. That enables two dates in the system. For this transaction, the system has set my transaction date based on the monthly frequency. I can override that and move it ahead to the 31st of July and the reversing date, August 1st. I've completed the required fields, the reference that stays with the transaction, and notice that my line entries are zero. I'll go ahead and input amounts to create a balanced entry that I can again post for this particular month. Notice that the system helps me to balance the entry by providing the difference. Now I'm able to navigate back to the batch entry window, close and save the transaction behind it. That leaves the batch ready for posting. On my general posting journal that I've sent to the screen, notice now that I have the transaction that I input for July 31st, and the system has automatically created the reversing entries for August 1st. If I return to the batch entry, I can again look up my batch. It's reflecting the last date posted now. I can again browse to transactions by journal entry, browse back one, and again my line items are set to zero. The system has automatically rolled forward my date based on the monthly frequency. This concludes my demonstration of the new functionality in Microsoft Dynamics GP version 2013 to clear recurring amounts in General Ledger transaction entry.